In today's tech tip, I'll be showing you how to install the Facebook app on your iPhone. So that's the easiest way to use Facebook on your iPhone. It's using the app. So what you want to do is go to the app store of your iPhone. So this is the app store icon. This is what it looks like. This icon or rather this app is available by default on every iPhone. So all you have to do is tap on it. And when the app comes up, you want to go to the search function in the bottom right corner, tap on that. And then it should see a search bar at the top here. So tap on the text box and then type Facebook and then type on search. So in the results, in the search results, you should see Facebook. You can tap on it just to have a better look and you want to install Facebook from Meta. So that is the company that provides the Facebook app. So just make sure you check that to make sure you, you install the correct app. Also, you can check out the ratings and also you should see the size before you try to install. So this one occupies 342.5 MB of storage. So make sure you have that available before you try to install. And so normally you'll see this button, it will say get if it's the first time. But since for me, it's not the first time, I'm seeing this little iCloud icon. So that's what you want to tap on, either get or this icon. So you can tap on that and it may require you to verify with the face ID if it's the first time. If it's not the first time, then it's just gonna go ahead and start downloading and installing Facebook onto your iPhone. Once the installation is complete, you can now tap on open to launch Facebook or you can just go to the home screen and you should see the Facebook icon, okay? You can tap on it that's going to launch Facebook. And then now you can go ahead and sign in with your Facebook account. Now, since I have multiple Facebook accounts, I'm just gonna go ahead and choose one. It has this data because I had previously saved, uh, or rather I was previously using Facebook on my iPhone. So that's why my data has been saved. So just go ahead and sign in with your username and password. And as soon as you sign in, you may or may not see the option to allow Facebook to send you notifications. That's personal preference. I'll choose don't allow and that. And now as you can see, I am signed in to my, my Facebook account on the app on my iPhone. So it's really that simple to get Facebook up and running on your iPhone. Thanks for watching. Comments and questions down below and good luck.